making weapon systems more precise. That's DARPA's key mission. The organization is charged with cultivating cutting-edge technology for the U.S. military. Current drone technology requires multiple technicians in far-flung places to identify, aim, and fire at a target. The delay costs precious minutes and can cause massive collateral damage. You want to know how big the collateral damage might be if you hit that target, because maybe there's a, a building next door that you don't want to have any damage done with it. One solution? Augmented reality glasses, allowing a soldier to exchange live tactical information with a drone flying overhead. The drone would send a video feed to the soldier's computer-enabled glasses, helping him calculate the best chance for hitting a target. With the glasses on, you can make a blast radius around the building so you know how far most of the material will go when you hit it. What you're looking at now is just a prototype, but eventually this target around my face could be used to highlight and separate the good guys from the bad guys, or facial recognition technology could zero in on a specific person. A company called Viewsix makes the technology. It's inked a $1 million one-year contract with DARPA to adapt it for use with military drones. And there's also potential for civilian applications. Having the ability to look around and know what the names of the faces you recognize are, just even walking down the street and, and seeing where potential stores might be. View Six says your glasses could steer you towards a sale on lattes at Starbucks or a bank with good interest rates. But experts worry that an avalanche of ads could obscure your view. We'll have to come up with rules to say maybe it's opt-in. You know, you might want to know when there's a coffee shop. Uh, you might want to know when there's a sale going on, but you might not. So when are these augmented reality glasses going to become a reality? Viewsix says the military version will be ready within a year. The cost, a million dollars apiece. Megan Hughes, Bloomberg, Washington.